Welcome to another Walters Works check-in. Hi everyone. Today's video is going to be a little bit longer than normal because I have a lot of progress to show off for the Tiki Bird project. Let's take a look. Since my last update, I was able to assemble the body using the vacuform bases I created in a previous video. They're being held together by tape at this time, but all of that will be covered by the fun fur and feathers, so you won't see it on the final product. I have this PVC pipe going through the body, and inside that is another pipe, connected to the head at the top and the handle at the bottom. When I move the handle to the side, the bird head looks like it's moving. When I squeeze the trigger, the lower beak moves. I was able to adjust the position so it opens and closes much better now. All the PVC pipe will also be painted to look like it's bamboo, so it's not so obvious. I did a few paint tests to see what looked best on the bamboo and came up with something that looks pretty realistic. And it'll look even better when I use the right paint colors. I also sculpted and 3D printed these toes and the plate that holds them, which also acts as a stabilizing base, so you can easily rest him against your arm or on your hand when you're using him as a prop or on the base for storage. I just love these little birdie toes. Well, that's all for now. I do have some ink and some feathers coming in soon, so hopefully I'll be able to finish up the bodywork later this week. Thanks for watching. Stay safe, stay healthy, and remember to wash your hands. Bye!